All right, welcome back, Costa 50 and 650 folks. Professor Almeida here. Happy Thursday morning, everyone. It's a lovely morning to be out, but later on, I'm going to be hanging out in the Canvas live chat from 9 until noon today if you have questions about your Word assignments for the week. And just to quickly recap, on Monday, we went over the first chapter of Word where you learned how to get around in the software and in the project, you learned how to put together a flyer. And then Wednesday, we went over chapter two, which covered the tools for creating a research paper. And I hope that you find those tools in the references tab useful the next time that you have to uh, write a term paper for the semester. Now, I want to talk about week six which is already open and available. But before I do that, just a couple of quick reminders. And I did go over this in class yesterday. So let me go ahead and talk about this again. If you need to seek out support, whether it's getting Microsoft 365 installed on your system at home, or if you get stuck on the projects we've covered in class you do have the cos computer labs available to you and our instructional assistants can also help you if you get stuck on a step now they are not your personal tutors but they can generally assist you with getting through the assignments and we'll talk about tutoring in a moment here if you are working from home you do have the student technology help desk if you need support with LBCC technology and this also includes installing Microsoft 365 on your home system so for example here if you're running Windows 11 at home and you need to install Microsoft 365 you can go to office.com log in with your student ID at lbcc.edu and then over here to the right you will see this install and more button you can choose install Microsoft 365 apps and then from there you will see install office and then you just basically follow the prompts. So again, it is important that you have access to a Windows PC if you are working from home, but if not, you can go to the COS computer labs. Again, here are the posted hours. And then finally, if you do need to sit down for a one-on-one -on -one tutoring session. There is a COSA 50 tutor available through the Multidisciplinary and Success Center. Here it is for COSA 50. So there is someone available from generally 10 to three, Monday through Thursdays. Again, you don't wanna wait until the weekend uh, when it's too late to get support. And on that note, let's take a look at week six. So the game plan for next week. On Monday, we will wrap up Microsoft Word with Chapter 3 on formatting text and graphics. And you can see here in the overview from Week 5, these are the skills you're going to learn for Word Chapter 3. So again, we're going to do the project together in class. And then in your downtime, you're going to work on your training. For Wednesday, it's going to be exam day and you will have the entire class meeting to work on on your three exams. Now, the exams are a lot like apply mode in the training sim. And as a matter of fact, whatever steps they showed you for a particular task, it's going to be the same thing for the exam. Now, I know that there are different ways to get to the same endpoint in Word, but if the training sim shows you a particular way, you want to stick to that just in case. You do get three attempts per task, and just like with TFS, if you need to step away from the exam, you can just close out of the window and come back where you picked off. One last thing, and I forgot to mention this with the projects, you do have the walkthrough videos, okay? You do have the walkthrough videos in case you missed something in lecture. I noticed that attendance dropped off a little bit yesterday. These videos are not a substitute for showing up to class, okay? You all signed up for a face-to-face -face class for a reason, and when you are in class, you and I both know that you're getting the work done, okay? So on that note, enjoy the rest of your week, 
and I will see you in the Canvas live chat later on at uh, 9 this morning. And again, I'll be there until noon. Uh, don't forget your support options. Have a good weekend, folks. I'll see you on Monday. Take care.